guys, it is so bright. Welcome to another vlog, it is Monday morning. I have decided that I'm gonna do the Couch to 5K app again, this is not sponsored. Um, oh wow, my hand from the self tanner, love that. If you guys are watching the vlogs back in 2020, peak pandemic, I decided I was gonna become a runner. Um, little backstory, I actually hate running, so I don't know why I'm doing this, but I just want like something new and a new challenge, and that is what Couch to 5K is to me. I also decided I'm documenting this journey on TikTok because it's gonna make me stick with it. And it, I don't know why I decided to start when it's 90 degrees outside, but it's also nice because it's gonna make me get up and get going early so I beat the heat. So that is what I'm doing this morning. Um, tonight I have a little um, Dallas influencer event for the Okine. Today we're just getting, getting life back together. So I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. Subscribe if you guys have not already. Follow me on Instagram, I'm actually getting so close to 100K, which is very exciting. I'll show you guys my little running outfit for the day. I need to get new running clothes, I'm gonna get new running shoes. This is not. My shorts are Amazon, my top is Year of Ours. I'm wearing Allbirds. These are the ones that I ran in last year, but I wanna get, oh, whoa. I think I wanna get Hoka's or something. Like, I'm taking this seriously, okay? Back for my run. So today was easiest. It's like obvious, oh my gosh, hi. Day one obviously is the easiest. It was just six intervals of one minute running and one and a half minutes walking, so that was easy. Guys, Coco is just, like have you ever seen anything so sweet and so cute? Okay, girl. I got a mattress topper, so I'm gonna unbox this and get this going. I've got a lot of like just random computer work and stuff and I'm trying, ooh, ow. I wanna finish this stuff because I really wanna go buy new running shoes today and I don't know if I'll have time, so. Getting set up for a morning of work. I need to make some breakfast. I'm gonna make sure the apartment has a good vibe. I feel like I say this like literally all the time, but I am so affected by my environment. Like if the vibe of my house, sounds so stupid, but if the vibe of my house is off, like I'm off. I can't, I can't literally can't do anything. Anyways, also, hi guys. I'm glad that we're vlogging again. I just like miss, I feel like I used to be better at vlogging. Maybe at home, I feel like it's like my home vlogs that haven't been as good. Um, but I wanna just like include you guys in more and like take you through just everything. What do you guys want in vlogs? Oh, by the way, I did. Who are your favorite vloggers? My favorite are definitely Julian Hunter. Um, and then obviously like, oh, and then obviously like Danielle and Brooke. I think I'm gonna pick my Get Super Mug. This mug is like one of my favorites. I love a good like glass mug. Um, and Get Super Coffee, by the way. So you guys will see it later because they sent for our gift bag to the Okai that I'll be making. Um, it's CBD coffee, so if you have anxiety and coffee affects you negatively, I'm not making it right now, but I do drink it. It's really good. It's like instant coffee. Um, if you have like laid off caffeine because it makes your anxiety worse or anything like that, and you want to drink coffee, like you don't want your anxiety to take that from you too, basically, um, Get Super is incredible. It's CBD coffee. It helps so much. I have the founder of the podcast. I, I hate being me sometimes. It's really tough to be me, okay? Anyways, here we go. I've been trying this Chobani oat milk. Oh my God. Like, is there anything more satisfying than like this? I finished Emily Henry's new book, Book Lovers, last night. And I just wanna say like, I just like at first, the first half of the book, I wasn't into it. And I was like, this is just not like Beach Read, which is like one of my favorite books. If you haven't read Beach Read, you need to. But then I got to like 60% of the way through and I loved it. So I will be doing a review on KE Book Club Instagram, which is my little bookstagram that I just started. Again, anything more? You know, I'm gonna make avocado toast. The Okine is hosting an influencer event. Jessica is under the weather, so she's not gonna be able to make it, unfortunately, but we are doing like a little bit of a launch type event. Obviously, it's like a few weeks late, but like it's fine. At Shine Hot Pilates, which is where I go in Dallas. It is by far my favorite like workout place in Dallas. You guys can use code Join Kenzie for your first class free. So we're hosting it at Shine Hot Pilates. We're gonna go hang out for a bit. Obviously, they're gonna get like goodie bags. So we're doing the Okine Tote tops, emotional entrepreneur book, Scout Scent, get super coffee. Um, and then we're doing a Pilates class, which is gonna be really fun, really chill. We do have balloons coming from Lusha, 
which I'm really excited for. So, cannot wait. Absolutely gonna be a fabulous night. But I have a lot of work to get done in the meantime, so. Y'all, this is the garage right now. I'm not proud. I'm not proud at all. Down here, because I'm gonna pack bags for our, um, what is it, our event tonight. All right, y'all, Amanda and I are back. Um, we're going, she's happy to be with me. We're gonna go to Bandera because I obviously have to get running shoes now that I am a runner again as of six hours ago. So are you gonna do Couch to 5K with me or not? Oh, is it an app? Yes, and I started today, this morning. Well, why would you start and not tell me when it's Because, the, well, I was texting you all weekend and you ignored me. I uh, didn't, you... Um, but actually, no, because the first run, run is literally you run for a minute, you walk for a minute and a half, six times. So I didn't feel like you even needed to start off on that one. I'm doing it on TikTok though. I'm oh keeping up the journey then. Are we running outside? Yeah, but in the morning at like 7.30 and it was it was actually really nice this morning. Oh my god. Yeah. I'm stressed. So it's gonna be, and it's only three times a week. And we don't have to run together every time. We just like keep each other accountable. But like, am I gonna run? Yeah. Well, I'm gonna do it tomorrow so you can start with me on day two. Frank even said it works. So, anyways, I'm wearing the Okine top, set active set, and I'm gonna go get new sneakers. Guys, the anthropology, I think it, I love this one, it was my favorite one. We think it closed down, but they're also doing construction. So like maybe that's why. Dang. All right guys, no luck with the running shoes. Unfortunately, they were out. I'm a runner now, so no luck. Literally, so. We're going home, unless you want to stop somewhere else. Is there anywhere else you need to stop? We're going home to work. <laughs> I know. Um, I did end up, you know Instacart is like literally my best friend. I had so many errands to run. Didn't have to run any of them, well I did, but not all of them because Instacart, duh. So now we're heading back home. That was our little lunch break thing. This is killing my vibe. Oh, my house right now is spotless. We are back. I'm gonna order shoes online, no luck. Um, I did get this stuff from Instacart for the workout, huge water bottles. I was gonna do Celsius, they were out, but I feel like drinking a Celsius at a 7.30 p.m. workout class is a horrible idea. So I feel like I should've stick to water realistically, cause like, you're not gonna sleep. So we're gonna do that. Um, I have some more computer work I need to do today. Finalizing some stuff for, um, oh my gosh, I have my Kindle. Finalizing some stuff today for our sip and shop on June 11th. It's a Saturday. Actually, let me get the details out, guys. If you're in Dallas, we're doing a pop-up. June 11th, 12 to 3 p.m. at DeNovo Active. We are doing a sip and shop, so we need you guys to RCP if you're gonna come and how many people you're gonna bring, things like that, because we're gonna have inventory for you guys to shop the new drop that we're shooting tomorrow that you guys will see. Um, so if you guys want to, I would love for you to come. It'll be very fun. I'm currently posting on KE Book Club for the book that I finished last night. This afternoon, I have gotten a lot of emails done. I have planned out a lot for the Oak Kind in the fall. I am so excited. Like, we have so many things this summer that, like, I'm just literally so excited. So, anyways, been doing that, working on emails, working on, like, just normal Kenzie Elizabeth stuff. It is 4.30. I'm going to leave in about an hour and a half for the event and then take you guys through that. I'm also going to be, like, doing a lot of TikToks and stuff. Um, but we're hosting our first... Dallas influencer event. We have about, I think like 15 influencers coming, 10, 15, and then uh, my management's coming, Presley and one of my best friends is coming. It's gonna be really fun. Amanda's coming because she's on my management team now, which is very convenient. But I'm just really excited. Very, very excited. I also wanna say like having a business is really hard. It has just made me, like I've always been the person, I think that like supporting people around you and your friends is, incredibly important so like i'm always 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 buying people's things just because that's like a life pillar of mine is like supporting other people and it's just something i care about so i'm always buying other people's products posting as much as i can like things like that for friends um and even just like random female owned businesses i see like online but this has made me have a whole new appreciation for it like i see anyone comes out with anything and i'm like immediately buy immediately buy like because i want to support but i also know how much it means as a small business owner so anyways, random like, thought, like also pillar of my life. I just, like, one of my biggest things has always been supporting other people is my point, but I think I'm, I'm really taking it to a whole new level at this point. Um, oh my God, guys, look at her. 
Hi, Coco. Oh my god, are you crying? <gasps> Girl. You look so cute. Oh, cutie. Cutie. Oh my gosh. So, speaking of supporting other females, not that she needs my support, but I don't know if you guys have seen all of her TikTok, the Bobby Brown stuff. Um, it's really cool. She signed a 25 year non compete when she sold the original Bobby Brown cosmetics. And then she opened up her new company literally the day that, that 25 year thing was up, which I thought was cool. So, anyways, I wanted to try some of it. I will try some of it tomorrow and actually wear it. But I picked up a few things. The what the foundation, WTF, but it's like foundation, people are like losing their minds over. I didn't, I don't know if this is gonna be the right color. Oh, it's really dark. So uh, maybe too dark. I really like the packaging though. Super cool. Then I also got Golden Shimmer. I don't remember what this was. I got lip glosses. Oh, that's pretty. I can try these right now. And this one I'm sure is like more pink. I love a bright pink lip. Bright pink, let's see how I like it. Wow, it feels like the like Juicy Tube, whatever. Was it Juicy Tubes? It feels like that obviously application wise, but the actual product itself feels a lot nicer. Let's take it, better lighting. Oh, wow, I love that. Yeah, okay, well, it's approved by me. All right, y'all, then I got the Summer Fridays Vitamin C Serum, which I love Summer Fridays, and this is one of my favorite Vitamin C serums. So nice to have on hand, because I'm always running out of them, um, but I love Summer Fridays specifically. Honestly, they're lip products. Like, the lip balms are so good. All right, I'm off to host my first influencer event for my own brand. Everything's pretty much done. Here we go. We're off in the with Amanda. We're going, we have like 10 influencers coming and then my management and then two of my friends. So, really excited. Even. Well, you, that's salary, that's different. Guys, yeah, well, it's important. Need a raise. It's important. <laughs> Send this vlog to Lindsay. <laughs> it's important to put your friends to work. Look at what's happening You have to work right for now. friendship these days. Literally, you can't just have friends for free. No, they have to work. Are you evening the numbers though? Mm-hmm. Wait, no, Kinsey, this is one, two, three, four. There should be one more. Mm. I think there's 11. Good. Are you ready? Smile. Let's go. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Wait, do a little, this is a video, so. I want a little. Cute. Well, we got it. Anyways, we're going in to the event, guys. Get ready. Oh, ready? Wrong way. But also, she has oh, a bread wedding house with Tumblr. That's your payment for today. Yes. <laughs> As we made it, look at the balloon. They're from Lush Raw. If you guys don't even live in Dallas, if you live in Dallas, hire them. If you don't live in Dallas, you can hire or you can order like a balloon set online to do this. Unbelievable, love. So cute, how are you feeling so far? Great. Good. It's hot as Hades, right? Yeah, it is hot. We have the inside here, gift bags, waters, balloon. been working doing some editing um i have a new mattress pad this is really exciting first off if that went really great it was so good to see everyone everyone's so nice and coming to support and it was really just meant the world back at home this mattress topper it was really a workout i just want to say that workout was crazy so adult i've been really looking forward to this mattress topper obviously i'm gonna shower but i'll give you guys an update once I have one, because it just, oh, and the fact that it's higher too. I still haven't found my bedding that just like literally disappeared. Good morning, guys. I'm sore, okay? That, this mattress pad, is my best and worst purchase. It's hard to get up in the morning. Very, very hard when your bed is this comfortable, especially when you have like a weighted blanket. And it's a cooling weighted blanket. It's from Luna, I think. Um, I mean, it's just like, I think I've perfected this whole sleep thing. I literally feel like I'm in college or like 
a boy who has like navy sheets on without my actual bedding. Anyways, I'm about to go on a run. I'm not going to Pilates today because I figured that would be too much. Tonight, we're shooting the Bourbon House by Summer Collection, so I'll show you guys all that stuff. Oh, and I need to get a blowout too. And work, and I need to get my eyebrows done, and like, you know, we've got we've to pull some things together. All right, here is my outfit for today. Year of ours set. I'm wearing all birds, but I already have my first pair of shoes being sent to me as of yesterday when I became a runner. By the way, Hoka's are out of stock everywhere, even online. Like, I thought it was just gonna be an in store thing. It's not. So, anyways, I'm gonna get a run. I need to get my eyebrows on today. I need to get a blowout. I need to work. I need to play an outfit for the shoot. The shoot's tonight. You know, we gotta, we gotta make some moves, okay? Alright y'all, I just self tan, which is probably not a good idea um, when I'm going to get a blowout because there's going to be water, but I self tan, I moved my blowout up, so I'm going now at 10, and then I'm also hopefully getting my brows done, which I also self tan. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be interesting. I'm wearing the Dallas pants, they're the best ones ever. I literally live in these. Right, conveniently, it seems as though Amanda stole my sunglasses. I'm going to get a blowout, my favorite thing. I'm working from the chair. I get so much done. I also just had a genius idea for the Okrine. This isn't really a business, a business and fitness girly vlog. I had the best idea the other day for a fall drop and then I had another incredible idea today. Like I'm so excited for the stuff that's coming. Like it's great. The Ryan set guys will be out within the next few weeks. Be sure that you're following along. We're having like production setbacks. It's been very stressful, but it is coming. Anyways, I'm excited. And then I'll show you guys the Brevity Housewife collection. Like we've got a lot going on. This is a business girly vlog. <laughs> It's gonna fall a ton, but it feels so much better. Okay, so what I was trying to say is that I always get a lot of curls, so it looks crazy at first for them to then fall because by tonight they will look perfect. Now I'm getting my brows done, which is like three weeks overdue. I'll update y'all because my face put self tanner on and I'm getting my brows waxed. So this is like really risky business. All right, update guys. Honestly, I mean, it's not good. That's what we look like now. So I love that. All right, I have my lunch, my vegetable soup, I have some toast, water. I'm actually thinking I'm gonna add a console here. I'm watching the toast. Like a little console here, get a rug. My new coffee table will be here. It's gonna be very cute. But I think I need a little console, like a little curved one, like a CBG one, you know? All right, y'all, it's time to show you the new Brevetting Housewife stuff. We've got the Spirit jersey. This is what I've been so excited for. It's been in the works for, I just love it. Like. How fun, Brevetting Housewife on the back. It's also puff, whatever, puff print. BWH, I mean, I'm obsessed. And then we have our Sophie shorts. So good, this stuff is old. We have koozies, a little wine cooler, and then we have this blanket that you can use as like a picnic blanket, it's lighter, or you can use it as home decor, like I have it on my couch, I know I've shown it to you guys before. I'll give you guys better views when we're actually shooting. I am so excited, this is my favorite drop by far, like this, this stuff is just so good. I'm wearing the Sophie shorts right now. I'm gonna live in them this summer. I mean, they are just so good. Oh my God. Hi guys, I'm gonna do a little bit of a Trader Joe's haul because I just picked up some stuff for the shoot. First things first, I have flowers. Cute, right? Next, I have some alcohol, um, I have wine. I'm gonna use it for the shoot. I'm not drinking it. I have Stella, and then I got one single, oh, like a Topo Chico hard seltzer just for the koozie, you know, for like the vibe. Then I got a baguette. So the baguette's broken, whatever. And then, um, oh, I got a bunch of fruit and stuff just for home. So that's my haul. We're gonna start shooting in like 20 minutes. I got here early just to like make sure I knew what I wanted, the vibe, you know? And I'm feeling good about it. We're only shooting like two things in the neighborhood and then we're gonna go down to the water. So this is actually the neighborhood that like I really wanna live in one day. It's um, the most beautiful place literally ever. Mm -hmm. 
That is it for this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm so excited for the photos. I'm so excited for the launches. Hope you guys enjoyed. Also, is it annoying when I'm like sharing things before they're out? Because I like taking you guys through the process and also a lot of it is just so much of my day to day that it's like kind of hard to vlog without it. I mean, I could like find other things and just like manufacture them some, some stuff, I guess. Um, but I really do just like taking you guys along the process. Like I feel like the vlog viewers just like get to know more, you know? Um, just made some fake bouquets that I need to, not fake, but like not the best, that I need to fix. I'm going to read for the rest of the night, but I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. People come in and say, I'm gonna be the next Kenzie. It, it's too late, you're a second rate version of Kenzie. If you wanna say, I'm gonna be the next Lauren Everett or Skinny Confidential, it's too late, that already exists. You wanna be the next Caller Daddy, that already exists. You wanna be the next Joe Rogan, he already exists. You can't follow in the footsteps of things that are already great. You have to you have to figure out your own path that can't be duplicated. And the only thing that can't be duplicated is your own authentic voice and your own authentic perspective. Life changed for me completely when I woke up one morning and was like, I am just going to talk exactly how I am on a mic. 